Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie. This is episode 54 of Ocean Block. <laughs> and today we're going to go over what I've done in between episodes and uh, we're going to contemplate in the game some more. <laughs> uh, see if we can figure out what we need to start producing and uh, how much. So let's, let's go have a look. Um, I did go exploring a little bit, and, uh, let's see, I went off to the east, apparently, way, <laughs> way off to the east, there's another little pocket of deep warm ocean over there, uh, but I was just, uh, looking for metal barrels, trying to find trinkets, and yeah, I found another uh, one of the heart pieces. So now I have four of them. Got the first, the fifth, the third, and the second. So I need the fourth piece. Mm -hmm. um, that would be that would be awesome. Uh -oh. That would be awesome. Uh, because then I'd have 30 hearts, <laughs> which is way better than 28. Um, I did a lot. Uh, I went ahead and put the modular storage back down, and uh, since we had a tier 4, which is the biggest, uh, I went ahead and Threw that in there. See it over here. It's the tier four one. Um, and I threw all of our treasures, in, <laughs> all of our quest rewards and stuff in here. Um, I think I still have more to move down from the top, the tippity top. Uh, but it's not much. Yeah, it's like all the records, which isn't really a quest for reward. It's more like loot. Get um, that song stuck in my head. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, I want that pot. Uh, I was leaving all the animal stuff in there uh, because that's where I cook anyway, so that would be a great place to have it. Oh no, I didn't want that to come in. Where'd it go? Oh, it's kind of laggy. Put you over here. There. There. Um, I built this uh, seed processor. I only got it up to Imperium because I was short on uh, Supremium, not Supremium. Uh, well, I am short on Supremium uh, because I made I, put it I made an Awakened Draconium Seed. Uh, I believe this one needs a Crux as well, uh, like the Nitro did, because it's showing up as Cruxes here. You have to have this Awakened Draconium Crux, which is another four insanium, three awakened draconium blocks, which I don't have, and another heart. Uh, but I do have a couple of hearts, uh, so I could make it, I could make it, um, but I don't think it's a hurry because 
I don't have the four. Oh, look, there's enough in there. I was uh, limiting myself because I didn't have the insanium, uh, but I have enough for four uh, because I went through and made the seed processor, uh, reprocessor, which uh, breaks down the seed and gives you the appropriate essence. I thought it, they would all just give you like the prudentium or what is that stuff called? Inferium. I thought it would give just all of the seeds would give inferium, but they don't. <laughs> they give whatever resource they they gather. Uh, so I figured I would uh, look through my seeds and see which ones I need the most of. And look, I got another 4K storage for it in there. What? I think it's a storage. Yeah. Storage. Storage housing. Ooh, that's another. Nope. I thought it was another three, but I already have a 16. Three sixteens now, and as soon as I make another four K, I have four sixteens. You're not there. <laughs> nice, and I've reworked this area, uh, cleared it up, and put in some more crafters uh, because they're all full. Uh, so now I have like four almost empty ones over here. This one has stuff in it. So I have, uh, I like putting the exporters on uh, where I can reach them so I can add uh, all the items easily without having to go around to the back. So I made sure I put all of the uh, exporters where I can reach them. Except for here. <laughs> Look at that, the importers are down. Um, yeah, they're, oh no. Yeah, um, that was before I realized, that's probably one of the reasons why I want the exporters uh, where I can reach them because uh, it's kind of a pain when they're not here. Um, so yeah, I put the sluice back up over here with the gold mesh since we need the crystal shards and um, turned on uh, the end essence to where it's getting sent back over here and turned into in stone. So that's good. Uh, and then the in stone gets crushed automatically, gets sent to this pulverizer, uh, get pulverized, which then gets sent over there. Only it's not very fast uh, because I only have the one end plant. So we're going to have to come up with a a better way to produce um, the end stone. I mean, I could just go to the end and mine some manually. <gasps> what? <laughs> I barely hit it. <laughs> I barely hit it. So I'm trying to think. Oh, I finished setting up. Uh, the lava production. I got this whole thing filled and I am finding uh, this guy is actually running out of cobblestone. So <laughs> the, the tier one cobble gen can't keep up with 
How many is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I can't keep up with eleven, so I'm gonna have to upgrade that. But it's like five blocks of uh, of stone, and I don't have any grout. I guess I could make grout. Uh, don't have any. I think I have clay balls in there. Just make up a stack. I think I can just smelt that up. That's what I want. There we go. Um, turn that into this. I think I'm going to need get the collagen. Let's grab it. Got a little bit of lag there. Ooh. Oh, it finally converted. <laughs> I didn't really need that one, but here we go. lava. Yes, I do. So I'm going to smelt those five bricks. Um, let's throw those down over there. Oh, it's almost there. Got five blocks of seared stone. It's almost there. And it's turning. Ah. Why can't I get it out? Okay. It's a slag. <laughs> I may need to restart again. All right. Now they've all shut off because they ran out. There we go. Now they're all going again. Hopefully that one can keep up. I'll keep an eye on it and see what, uh, if I need to upgrade it again. Uh, I did add the Awakened Draconium over here because I had an empty spot. <laughs> uh, we have 24 Awakened Draconium ingots left. Uh, so that's cool. I want to... I want to get this to... Um, upgrade all the way to... In, uh, insanium now. So I need to apply that to where it stays in here. And then I need to get the Supremium because I, it's way easier to break it down than it is to deal with crafting it. So now we need to get another recipe 
that will convert it up to insanium. Why won't you let me go? Okay. Apply. So want it to be XC uh, because I want it to leave the master infusion crystal there and then put the insanium out. Let's see if it works. There we go. That's super duper awesome. Now we have insanium. Oh, the, the right click clear also works in this, which is kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Um, so what else? I've been uh, wanting to make another reactor. <laughs> I'm scared that if I do, I'll start running out of things. So let's check, how are we doing on redstone? Well, we got over 20,000 redstone. Um, coal, got over 22,000 coal. What about ice? Uh, I got over 1.7K blue ice. so much essence. I guess it's not taking it in very fast. Um, I just did all those seeds so there's a bunch of ice essence. Nice. Um, so I guess we could make another reactor. Because if I'm going to plant that awakened draconium, uh, I think I might want to put it in a power pot. Uh, so the power pot would require another reactor. So let's see. I might want to teach it how to make a reactor because I, I might need multiples of these. So let's see, just reactor. We want the nitro one. There we go. Um, I believe it already knows all of those and the dielectric casing so all i'd have to do is teach it this recipe and it should be able to make it oh and put it there <laughs> fine it's fine okay so now I should be able to come in and request 36 why did you not go 36 and then it just make it oh look at that oh <laughs> that's amazing so what do we need all in here um, we need an exporter. To pipe everything in. And then, um, let's put, find an area down here. Um, if I put it over here, I could easily just run the cable down 
and feed it. Oh yeah. What? That's awesome. Okay. So, what I want this for is just, just to run a power pot. Preferably the awakened draconium one. So I think I might set it up and then put the power pot right in front of it. Uh, so that would mean I would need an ender chest. See, and this is why I like, oh, I, look, I already had one. It's like I knew. <laughs> it's like I knew. I knew the stuff. Um, and we do have a hopper botany pot that I got. What did I do with it? Um, so we can upgrade that to a power pot. I feel so much better now that I can uh, auto craft the, the the reactor. So that's pretty nice. Power pot. No, we don't want the Mark IV. Mark One. Cast iron, two emeralds, and a basic energy cube. I wonder, do I have a basic energy cube? This is why I wanted to be searched, <laughs> to have this uh, basic. No, I don't have one in here. I wanted to be able to search through it because I'm starting to get so many things, it's hard to keep track of it. Um, so, we need four Cast iron blocks, two emerald. Oh, I don't have the cast iron. Oh, and I can't, I can't make it. Because I don't have a free metallurgic infuser they've all got things in it other than coal uh, so I'd have to make another metallurgic infuser unless of course I have one here. I'm running out of room. And then I think it's one for one for each. Uh, one iron use one coal. Oh look, how come I have so much iron clogged up? I bet I need to upgrade that machine now. Since I doubled everything. Oof. No components. Okay. Um. Oh, 
let me go get this started. So that can be making. Uh, we, we also need the energy cell. Is it called the energy cell? Um, basic energy, it's an energy cube. Not a cell, that's why I couldn't find it. So we need a steel casing, uh, which means we need structural glass. Boom, 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 boom. And two energy tablets. There we go, basic energy cube. Oh, and it's already filling up. So we have that. We just need we need we need the cast iron. Oh, this is so slow. speed upgrades get immediately used. Because <laughs> I like my speed. Um, yeah, we should have that and that. We just need osmium dust. I think you can have eight. So we need eight osmium dust. Look at that. Uh, we got our osmium chest plate in. Alright, I've had the mob system going on to try and help uh, increase the essence, the Imperium essence uh, input. Okay, now we need, we need the speed. so slow. There we go. Is that better? Oh yeah, that's much better. the system to always keep a couple stacks of teach it that uh, but I need a whole nother I'm running out of room for my automations <laughs> need to tell it teach it to keep a couple of stacks of cast iron okay do we have enough 
Yes. What? <laughs> Oh, yeah. That's much better with the speed upgrade. There we go. Now we got some more. So now we can go make another power pot. Um, let's see. Oh, I forgot. We gotta do these one at a time. power pot. Um, I could upgrade the first one, but it uh, it takes over a hundred thousand and the reactor has only produced 80. So eh. um, but we need to go down um, there was no seed quest for awakened draconium either. Uh, if we look at in-game things, there's a Wyvern Energy Core Singularity. So it takes Wyvern Energy Core Controller 1500 of them. That's a lot of draconium, because that's uh, 4 times 1500. like 6,000 and then you need a, draco a draconium core which is another four so that's like 12,000 draconium ingots wow and there's a cast iron singularity a dimensional shard singularity plastic Blazing Capacitor. Cake Singularity. A Silicon Singularity. We could probably do this one. It takes 1500 Silicon. We got that. No problem. See? We're learning things. Uh, so silicon we could do, sawdust probably, clay, oak, um, I have it to where it's like using all my oak, so I probably don't have that, sea pickle, capacitato, what does that take, potato, cured rubber, Black nuggets and redstone. Cool. Oh, I forgot. This is why is this not done yet? Oh, it's just taken forever. Oh, um, kind of. I got blazing on there. Man, that takes forever. <laughs> um. Okay, we'll come back to that. That'll get done eventually. Uh, cause I remembered something else that I did. Oh yeah, uh, 
this is the very first detector I've used in this series. Um, and I just have it to where it's going to automatically detect uh, the seeds. This is, um, if we look, we have 64 inferium seeds. So I wanted to use up all the inferium seeds, uh, but leave some in case I want to increase my farm size, which I need to do. Um, so I put the detector on there and it detects uh, if there are 64. Uh, it emits a signal when it's above the amount. So this thing will operate with a redstone signal. Uh, so as soon as it gets redstone signal, it starts putting in inferior seeds and turning them into inferior essence. So it's pretty cool. I like it. All right, let's check on our power pot. Is it done? No. <laughs> oh, just perfect timing. Nice. Um, now we need the farmland. Um, to be Insanium Farmland. So, if I put this right like that, it should pull power? Maybe? I don't know. this that no no all right how about I was hoping I could get... Oh, it gave it back. Awesome. Oh, now I need another hoe. <laughs> and I can, oh, I need to put this in directly because it won't get sucked in. Oh, and that's another one. That's the four that I needed. Uh, for the crux. Oh, the crux. The crux. so expensive. <laughs> that means I'm gonna have to make I'm gonna have to make one into awakened decronium and then use one in the recipe. <laughs> I need uh, 
leave this awakened draconium crux and it takes three awakened draconium blocks. Oh, dude. It takes four blocks of draconium and six draconium cores. Okay, we should be able to do this then. Oh no wait, the four blocks go in the middle. So we need to put these over here. here and then put you in the middle oh it's at least it's going pretty fast oh my goodness <laughs> oh my goodness so that'll give us the awakened draconium we need to make <laughs> the awakened draconium seed work and then we should have uh, a steady input income of awakened draconium because you can only kill the ender dragon so many times and then there's no more So I need to get um, where this is going. I need to get uh, an exporter. Does this matter if it's not in a block? Should I put blocks in there? I don't know. I haven't tried the, that to see if that helps. Let's go boop 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 and we should see yep it's coming on 
Oh, I didn't put water in it. I do want this on. It's building up power. Nice. Um, guess I could put my seed in there. What did I do with it? I put it up here. Let's check our check on our awakened draconium. Oh, there it is. Quest completed. Awakened draconium block. Nice. Um. <laughs> oh. So apparently I can place this guy here. And then just close this up. <laughs> A power pot. <laughs> Watched pot never produces. So that should dump 16 uh, bits of awakened draconium. And then I can uh, have it auto craft that into the ingots. Producing awakened draconium. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I guess I could put, uh, I don't know how many reactors I can support um, on this, on my current setup. Uh, like, I think this other reactor still has that dry ice in there. a long time. I just figure I'll use that up. So, yeah. Uh, next time, maybe we'll look into trying to 
make the silicon singularity and get that out of the way and, and see what it's like to actually make the singularity. Because uh, I've never done that before. So, anyway, we'll go ahead and end the episode here. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.